Hey guys, how's it going? Andrew here, Enough Said Cards on Tuesday evening. Uh, this is going to be a real quick video because I want to get back to the All-Star game. Uh, but I also wanted to show you the card that came in the mail uh, yesterday. Um, it's a card I've been looking for for a while. It's one of the cards I mentioned earlier in the year that was one of my goals for 2019. Um, so let's get right to it. And um, this is a T206 Ty Cobb portrait with a red background. Obviously, I have the grade covered up there. Wanted to give you guys an opportunity to look at the card and um, see what you think the grade might be before I show you. Um, really nice registration. Uh, nice centering. Uh, and, uh, you know, some rounded corners. There's a little crease on the bottom right there and a little chipping on that corner. Um, and uh, interesting shade of red. Some of them have really dark red backgrounds. Some of them are kind of a little bit more muted like this, and some of them actually look orange. If you look at enough of these, you'll see that there's a um, great range of background uh, shades of red. Um, but I saw this one on eBay, and I knew the person that was selling it, so I contacted him off of eBay and was able to negotiate a deal that I was just uh, really thrilled with. And um, I'll show you the back. This is a Sweet Capital 350, and you can see some staining there in the middle. Um, I believe that this card was once in a scrapbook and was uh, carefully removed, and that what accounts for uh, what you can see there on the back. Um, all right, so hopefully you've had a good chance to look at the card, and now to reveal the grade, and this is a PSA 1. Uh, poor to fair one. This is an old slab. You can tell by the flip there. Um, now they have has before they had half grades. So um, a 1.5 now would be a fair. Um, if I was to resubmit this, it could bump up. I don't know. Um, I don't really care at all about the grade. Um, just think that this is probably one of the nicer ones that you'll ever see. Um, and the reason that it got a one, and I, I think it is. Um, not inc incorrectly graded, although I think it could bump up slightly, is that if you look carefully, you see that there's some scuffing a little bit from where it was removed. Um, or I believe it was removed from a scrapbook. And then also there's a little bit of residue left from the glue or whatever the adhesive was um, that they used to, to put it in the scrapbook. But that really doesn't bother me. If you look at the prices for um, these red cobs, uh, even in twos, you know, threes, definitely fours and fives. I just didn't want to pay that. And, um, you know, to get a card that has this uh, eye appeal uh, for the price, you know, of a one, um, I was just really, really happy to get it. Um, so I'm gonna get back to this. I'm gonna show you this as well as my uh, green cob in a second. But I also wanted to show you uh, what came in the mail last week from Alex Bowman 53 and let's see if I can find a good way to show this to you. This is a poster, uh, bear with me one second, that shows um, all the uh, Red Sox from the T206 set and some of the T207s also. And uh, sorry for my dog barking and growling there in the background. Um, but I just think this is absolutely awesome. Um, sorry, it's not really focusing. Uh, I have the whole T206 team set, and I need some of these. This is part of the T207 set also. I need some of these, um, which I'm trying to pick them up slowly. But Alex, thank you so much uh, for sending this. I'm definitely going to get this framed up and uh, put it in my with my uh, card display. Get back to focus there. And uh, he sent a note with it also. It says, Andrew, hope you can find a place for this in your card room. See you at the National Alex Bowman 53. Uh, Alex, definitely this will go in my card room. And uh, once I have it framed and displayed, I will uh, show it again and so everyone can see how it looks. Um, and also definitely looking forward to uh, catching up with you at the National. Um, so let's take this. Carefully set it aside. Um, and then just one last look at the red cob. 
and I uh, just thought maybe I would display it with the green cob also. Um, and those of you that have watched my videos have certainly heard several times, uh, at least, the story of uh, the green cob and how my father bought it at a show in the mid 80s and paid, uh, it, it was either 20 or $25. I can't remember exactly, but not more than 25. Um, so thought those look pretty nicely together. And uh, at some point, hope to pick up the other two cobs from the T206 set, the bat on and the bat off, um, but not anytime soon. Uh, so that's it for tonight. Back to the All-Star game. I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.